should not have done this. Oh, it's the blood uh, red key labeled custodian's closet. Uh, <laughs> Hello, welcome back to Book of Gaming. Oh, I'm Eric. I'm Travis. And this is Qorps Party. Yeah, Otaku Tuesday's back again. Yeah, mm -hmm. this game's not very otaku, but here we it are. It sure isn't. It's got anime. It's there got... were actually there were pixel boobies. There were, so that make we that counts. we did need otaku there. That counts. You just have to make like a super pixelated version of <laughs> otaku <Yeah. laughs> to put over it. Yeah. Uh, uh you we'd... found a tongue in a bag yeah you're about to reunite a tongue with its long lost owner yeah mouth little kid yeah don't look into his eyes though just I'll try not him, to just throw the tongue at him and run yeah i'm gonna save real quick just in case okay he'll be like oh thank you now i can talk to you while i bury you alive yeah well it's just like if i accidentally like do the wrong thing can i i know no eye contact Right. I don't do that weird eye growing thing. I hate it. It's fucking. <laughs> yeah, but... Ayumi produces the boy's tongue from her bag, but nothing seems to be attracting its, his attention. He simply isn't noticing what it. What the fuck am I going to do with that? Notice me, tongue pie. <laughs> tongue pie? <laughs> <laughs> In order to give back his tongue, he needs to see it, to know we have it. So one of you has to sacrifice themselves. So it's got to be directly in his field of vision, huh? Can we, like, I don't know place it in front of him without looking him in the you eyes just like stick your hand in front of his face not gonna happen if his eyes meet mine i'm dead right and then what oh, wait hold up i've never seen you shake like that before it's fucking hot <laughs> oh it's gotta be jam because jelly don't shake like that <laughs> all right then i guess a man's gotta do what a man's gotta do hands it to i <laughs> don't plan the plan if you can't follow through he's all yours all that matters, take your matters into no, your No, stop, hands. you can't let his gaze be yours. Okay. What are you doing? No, stop, you can't let his gaze be yours. What do I do then? I... Do I look at him? I wouldn't. Well, I've got to do something. Just put it down. You can't access your item. Oh, yes, you can. <laughs> no, you can't. That's just to look at, examine. Can look at it. Can you not click the space in front of him? Huh. No. That's what I figured you'd have to do. Nope. Nope. Crap, he's looking right at me. <laughs> A do 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 He's doing the eye thing. He's fucking doing it. Ryo, Yoshizawa. Go to your room. Okay. That's right. I know your name. What's the matter, Dad? Cat got your tongue? <laughs> oh. Show him the tongue? Well, yeah. <laughs> no, and he just kills me. I feel bad for what happened to you, but I can't sympathize with what you're doing with the weird eye thing. I hate it. <laughs> Hurting strangers because of your own despair, pulling them into a horrible place like this, and killing them. You killed our dear friend. I fucking hate you. I'm never giving you your tongue back. I can never forgive you for that. That's why I'm going to eat your tongue right in front of you. <laughs> I'm so hungry. But this is yours. It's part of your body. So I'm going to give it back to you. Hand over, hand it over Rio's tongue. Rio, you, Rio, you, Rio, you. I don't know. My hand. My hand. My hand. My hand. My, hand. My tongue. <laughs> Thank you, miss. <laughs> oh, I thought she was laughing. <laughs> yes, pet, pet. Everything's great now. <laughs> pet, pet, pets. No, God damn it! What's going on? Ah. It's that teacher. Infirmary's She's the one behind it all. Damn it! <laughs> Another earthquake. Gotta be kidding me. And right when I'm next to these holes. <laughs> it's 
keeps happening to me. Oh, I'm fine. You get close to holes, and then there's just uncontrollable shaking. <sighs> I won't get anywhere by wallowing in self-pity here. Yuka, I swear I'll protect you. Please, wait for me. Hold it in. <sighs> first things first, though. I need to go check on Naomi. Okay, but as far as... Okay, no, it doesn't matter. Like, there's been a certain amount of time that we have been away from him. But he was just standing here. So he literally walked in here, saw that there was no room, punched the wall. There was an earthquake. and went, all right, I'm going to go check on Naomi. Yep, and there she is. Girl in the red dress. Hey! Hey, you. Wait. Oh! <laughs> Can't catch me. Playing hard to get. Pence, pence. Is that the ghost girl? Yeah, it's the, the one that wasn't part of the... Oh, you're playing Earthbound. Oh. Okay. Or not. Uh, that was cool, I guess. Sure. Where was... Where was... Where... I gotta go back to the infirmary, but where is that in... Coordination or... Hey, look. <gasps> I'll kill you, I'll curse you, it hurts so much, I hate your sister. There's a purple. There is a purple. Someone's cell phone's lying on the ground. Pick it up. Of oh, course. Yeah. I'm just collecting all the phones. <gasps> it's Psychos. Saiko's cell phone. She was writing a text message to Naomi when she dropped it. I bet I would have needed that to get Naomi to wake up. This is Shinohara's, isn't it? Psycho seemed to have been in the middle of texting someone when she dropped her phone. The text entry window is still open. While confirming the phone's owner, Satoshi wound up inadvertently reading the whole thing. Oops! <laughs> Shinohara. It looks like I'm wearing glasses now. <laughs> I'm sorry, Shinohara. I really didn't mean to. <laughs> and then his eyes drop out of his head like the fucking uh -huh. looking at the treasure map in Spongebob. <laughs> <laughs> I don't think Naomi should see this. Not now, at any rate. Delete. You Green are collecting phone. all the cell phones. What? This is a television. That is, isn't it? What are you watching? I look pretty happy about it. I did find that video cassette in the other building. Kibiki research data. Oh, damn it. I thought I was the Little Mermaid. <laughs> it might hold some important information. If only we had some way of watching it. Fingers crossed, I guess. I just still can't get in okay. there. Can you look at that same area that... What? That you looked at and found the thing. Like that that little area. Oh, there. right here? Yeah. Nope. Good call, though. Okay, so now what do you do? You gotta I gotta go to the infirmary. Cassette it. player? No, you gotta go to <laughs> Naomi. <clears throat> but I'm glad I went the wrong way, because if I didn't pick up that phone, I bet the fucking whole Naomi thing would be like, oh, she's not ready to wake up yet. Sorry. You know? I need something to wake up Naomi. Chuck a cell phone at her head. Right, of course. Look at that. You remember where the infirmary is. I remember no, this. No matter, right, we got this place down now. Except this After... one's slightly different because... Whoa. Oh. Oh. <gasps> Jesus. Naomi. Satoshi, please don't leave me alone in here like that. It's wrong? like the only person I... I guess I do, Yuki, too. What's wrong with your eyes? Sorry, I was out looking for Yuka. Oh, okay. That makes sense. Did you find her? No. The corridor that leads to where I saw her last went back to being a wall. Oh, yeah, we can do that. Yeah, that happens. I can't find any way of getting to the other building anymore. I throw you out the window. Oh, that, that'll work, the actually. Other building? There's a whole other building? Yeah. Looks like the school, Yuka, Mori, Shige, and I were in is different from this one. We needed to find some way of traveling from one space to another. That would be ideal, yeah. Maybe we can find a car or something? Wait a minute. Why are you standing out here instead of waiting inside the infirmary? I was attacked in there earlier by some kind of black shadowing mist. So I came and stood five feet from the door. <laughs> so I was a little scared to be in there. Afraid it might attack me again. You serious? I'm really sorry about that then. <laughs> Don't worry about it, but there's something in there for sure. I think we should keep our distance. That's great. And only go in there I'm like 14 or 15 more times. I'm going to go in there. No objections here. We're doing it. I 
wouldn't. Oh, fine. Where do we go then? I don't know. Now so, I have no indication on where to go. Nope. So what do you... you just got to walk around for a while. Oh I don't know. Maybe you do go in there, but there's there's no way, right? It's like, don't go in there. I know, but sometimes when it says don't go in there, it means go in there. Just like, don't look him in the eye. Uh -huh. And then I had to look him in the eye to give him his fucking tongue. So... All right. Well, I'll go in there then. I'm going in there. All right. You're going to fucking do it? I'm doing it. All right. I'm going to spoo. The worst thing it'll do is give you a bad end. Right. And then I just fucking load. There's nothing here. There is nothing in there. See, at least I can save, though. There's nothing in here. There's no black shadowy ghosts. Can't okay. even, you can't even look at the beds. So do I... Uh, now okay. do I take Naomi to the red room to try to get it open so I could go to, to watch the tape? Oh. I don't know. He was like, I bet there's a VHS player in here. Maybe someday I'll find a VHS player. Well, we the, that door's blocked. Yeah. But... Kick it over. Right. I mean... Use a fucking hammer or a crowbar. Yeah, I don't know. Just walk around for a while, and then Guess once you're I'm lost doing. for about 15 minutes, well, I'll look it up. Yep, I'll get good Gosh, and annoyed. It's been, it's been a dark a dark for a while. It has been a dark for a while. It's been a lot more a darkness recently. Nothing here. Why did I have to do this whole fucking maze just to get to nothing? This is anus. It's heinous airplanus. You gotta find the... John McCainus. Uh, ghost girl that led you over here. Right. In the red dress, apparently. She's the one that gives you the ghost sex. Please. Look in the things. It's full of stagnant water and dirty, dirty human, human hair. Dirty human hairs. There's a pair of glasses on the ground. Oh, I'm going to need Thelma. those. A prescription? Uh... Now you got to remember where everything is in pitch darkness. Of course. This is oh, the... Oh, now there's only two people. This is a different school, I think. Now two people hung themselves. It said there's no longer anyone in the stall. So. All right. Cool beans. Or no, that that was where Naomi and yeah. uh, Dingle Mahingle were. But you have Naomi with you. Yes. Dingle McCringleberry? Yeah, like, like that's the, the bathroom that they both tried to hang themselves in, but not actually. They didn't try to do it themselves. They just like... They were possessed to do their, so? Their brains made them do it. They did a heckin' melt. They got, yeah, they got teleported into nooses. Okay, then. So that is a useless area right now, so we're not going up there. That's right. the infirmary, not going there. Yeah. We know where everything is now, though, so we're okay. Go back kind to, of. like, where the wall was. I, That's helpful. It probably will. Oh, okay, that, yeah. Okay. Where the wall, there's, there's right walls there. everywhere, fuck. <laughs> <laughs> no. No, okay. I thought maybe Naomi would know what to do. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that's a wall. Pants, pants. Pants, pants. Do, 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 pants, pants. Pants, pants. This is the pants run. No, oh, well, we gotta go the no pants percent run. That's true. That would be nice. Hey, hey what's look at this going guy. on there, bro? He... There's a yellowed sheet of notebook paper on the floor next to the body. He peed on it. Shaking is the letter in the contents of the memorandum suggests that his writer was on the verge of death well before the pen touched paper. I need water so badly. Oh, my God. I'm hungry. Water! <laughs> sure, but I can deal with the <laughs> hunger. It's a thirst I can't stand. I need it! The other guy I was with, <laughs> Satoshi Matsubara, he tried drinking that filthy tap water from the sink at the bathroom. Probably what we should probably all done. But he threw it all up almost immediately, and it burned his chest and his throat so badly that it wound up dying. He should have boiled it with the ghost fires. Yep. I've tried to think outside the box, even going so far as to drink my own spit. That's... You do that constantly. But needless to say, it didn't help matters one bit. What about drinking your own pee? Everybody pees in this game. Mm -hmm. My tongue's so swollen at this point that I can't even talk. And ironically, it's been pouring outside since we got here. If only I could find a way to gather some of the rainwater so Toshi might still be alive. I could go walk on the other balcony, lift my head, and open my mouth. It's almost as if someone's playing a cool <laughs> oh, joke at me. There now. Showing me more water than I've ever seen before, but putting it just outside my reach. Somebody wrote that there's a hole or wing in the school access through an outdoor walkway, but I've never found it. I lost, for, I was lost for sort of I'm going to try drinking my own blood. That's probably smart. My name is Hunter Masi Kojima. I'm a vampire now. I'm an 11th grader <laughs> in class 2-4 at Amazaki West High. If anyone reading this ever makes it out of here alive, please tell my family. Tell my father what happened to me. I don't want to be a missing person for the rest of his life. Wait, of oh, his life. I hate the idea of him always wondering where I went or if I'm even still alive. 
It seems to continue, but the rest of it is completely drenched in- Oh, not the stop being a divorce, sorry, I'm done. Red Reader, totally illegible. Cool. What's up here? Anything? He's got the same first Corey. name as you. Cool. Last name? First name. Yeah, first. Hey, it's the, an shot. It's It's the Chinese that do their uh, family name first. Sure. Yeah, it is. I mean, in Japan, they go by their last names mostly, too. Do they? First name is, like, only if your friends are close to them. Oh, okay. That's why I call you Beam. Yeah. Because we're not friends. Correct. Well, where am I going? I don't know. I just I, I, I you got to wander. I have to click things and read things, then I forget, like, what I've been doing because all the fucking hallways look the same, except for the amount of pants. I need to, like, label the rooms based on the amount of pants they have. Oh, it's the six pants room. Of course. <gasps> there's a purple. Oh, there's a purple. The freaking purple. Give me purple. This door's gonna be sealed. No, it's not. Fuck yeah. Give me that purple, baby. Go. Oh, fuck. Oh, it's on the other side now. Freaking. Oh. Yeah, I gotta split up. Yeah. Not this again. Me, I agree, Satoshi. Okay, I'll stand here and keep watch. So that was. Okay, it's. I don't remember where it was, so I, do, I know where it it's is. It's next to the middle board. Yeah. Oh, you fucking flim flammy purple. It was right here? No, it was in the middle. This one. Can you tell it out? The lights change positions again. <laughs> Naomi, would you wait here? Sure, no problem. Oh. Oh, fuck, I'm dead. Yeah, it's okay. <laughs> <laughs> we don't need you. I don't know we have a party system anyway. It's not like there's fucking Naomi. battles. Now me, now. Grab it. Grab what? Okay. There's nothing over here. Oh, I got it! Oh my god, it burns! <laughs> I should not have done this. Oh, it's the blood uh, red key labeled custodian's closet. <laughs> <laughs> Four chapters in, we finally get in that stupid room. Yay! Nicely done in there. In Thanks, fact, I stood there. You seem totally unfazed. Did you figure out what we needed to do on your own or something? You're a girl. That's are impossible. You, are you like one of them smart brain girls? Actually, I had to do something similar before with Sacco. Thanks for bringing it up. Did you? Same here, but with Yuka. Are we the same character? Are we I think... the Pokemon protagonist, whether you choose boy or girl? We might be. Let's keep moving. We'll My find name her. is Satoshi. I know we will. That's Ash's, or that's the... Red. Yeah, Red's name. Yeah. Well, Ash's name in the in the anime. Oh. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. I don't remember how to get to the fucking red door. I think it was down here. I think here. it's down and to Pretty the sure right. it's down here, baby. See, this is fun. No, no, you no, got no, a key, no, no, you got two no, phones, no. and you got a VHS. My pockets are just jangling away. There's nothing here. Yes, there is. Yeah, it's do, 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 next to the infamery. Do, 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 do. Yeah, your pockets are full. You can't hold anything else. Oh, no. I was going to get some pants. What if you find another cell phone? I know. Oh, man. Oh, ew, gross. Ew. I want to get in that room. Should I have saved in the infirmary first? Nah, it's fine. Yeah, <laughs> we're fine. Oops. An unforeseen force is pushing you back. This is not the right this way. This is not the right what way. What did I do? How did I do this? I don't know. Did I completely miss my fucking turn to get to the red room? I think so. How did I pull that off? It's not in the infirmary one, is it? You said it was, so I thought it was. I thought it was. I thought it was up and to the right in the infirmary, but maybe not. It well, must. It's in that. It's in the, the. It's in the room that I took forever to find. Yes. No, this is the room. It's in I, the room. I... It's in the the room where the kid smelled the smelling salts. What? Isn't it? Up and to the right in there. Smelling salts. Or whatever, that charm that she gave you. We, then we said that he was sniffing it. I don't remember that at all. Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. Yeah, the, right, no. You know, to the it, left and up. I told you, everything looks the same in this fucking game. There's only like four different sprites oh, for holes. Yeah, this. And to the right, right? No. All three came from. I'm, I'm, I don't know. I'm watering. It's fine. Pants. Pants, pants. Do, 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 do. This is where I came from. Do, do, it is, do, but this do, is where the room do, is. Do, do. It sure is, because there's Dingle. Here it is. Yay! Custodian's closet. The door's, door's locked. locked. There's an erratic noise. Uses, Uses, yes. Yay! We finally made we it! We did it! Progress! Woo! 
death. Oh. <laughs> Ooh. Wow. Look, a TV. Cool. Oh. Uh-oh. Who turned out the lights? Such a cartoon thing to say. Who turned out the lights? <laughs> what the? What's going on? Why is it so cold? Ugh. Something really smells. I'm sorry. I'm scared of the dark. It's pitch black in here. Delicious. Can you find a light switch anywhere? I found it. It's a tiny little light switch. It's my penis. That's I'll my try. cock. Uh, hmm. I pull it out when I'm scared of the dark. But it's it's really hard, but it's pointed down. <laughs> <laughs> found it. That's how I do. Oh, oh, oh. Shoo. Thanks. Man, it does Man. stink uh, up. Yeah, they look exactly the same. They're the same character, just two different. It's MC and FEMC. Yeah, exactly. Man, it does stink in here, and it's not just mold, is it? Probably not. I'm... It's What's... advanced mold. <laughs> What's mold smell like? Huh, that's odd. What is? Oh, nothing. It's like deja vu. I could swear I've seen this room before. Probably. You. I mean, it is your school. It's an old Japanese style fusuma side indoor presumably opening to a closet. It's torn and standing equal measure throughout its surface. Cool. Something seems off about this closet. I get the feeling that this is one door we should know, but let's open it. I want <laughs> to so badly, but I won't. There's a video eight camcorder lying on top of the TV. Its cassette deck is empty. Its batteries also seem to have ran out, however, as the L C D display isn't turning on. Alright, take the batteries out of the cell phones. What is something? That, oh, what is something this recent doing in a place like this old? Sorry, I got a little excited. Yeah. Maybe it belonged to someone who was brought here, like us. Yeah, that does make sense. Unfortunately, there's no cord to hook it up to the TV, and it's out of batteries, so it doesn't look like we'll be able to get much use out of it. <laughs> Just chucks it to the ground. <laughs> it's useless. Fuck this. Ooh, a paper. There's a magazine article here from a publication called Strange But True, Stories of the Occult. It's followed the previous report. Read it. Sure. I guess. Strange But True, Stories of the Occult, chasing down the hidden past of the cursed school building follow-up by Kuo Kubiki. <laughs> Let's talk a bit more about Yoshi Izaku <laughs> Yanaguri, a beloved son of heavenly host to the major principal. Talk about a dog and you do Japanese. The man was born and his drug pure and simple. He took up the battle as soon as he could and performed his duties with perilous panache. None of this rhymes. But no. this, <laughs> but then <laughs> this the not struck. Flow. And little by little, his witted personality gave way to pure instinct to still lose it all since identity. Although the cause of this illness was unknown, its effect were anything but. Simply put, the good teacher had begun to revert to a childlike state. Ooh. He began carrying an antique doll with him at all times, a memento from a long forgotten festival perhaps given to him by his late mother. His behavior during class degraded quickly. More often than not, his lectures would cease before the period's end, and he began wailing mournfully. Finally, several months prior to the kidnapping and murder incident, Yoshikazu reached a point where he could no longer communicate his thoughts. Although he could still understand others, he became virtually incapable of forming words without intense focus. All he kept, kept just saying, Hodor. Yeah, and hitting people with hammers. Given all the evidence mounted against him, <laughs> Yoshikazu Yadagihuri was arrested on multiple counts of kidnapping for having too long of a last name, murder, and desecration of the dead. <laughs> but due to his mental condition, he was never able to confess his involvement in the crimes, nor even properly discuss them with authorities. Hodor. Everything hinged on the testimony of the sole survivor, one Sachiko Shinozaki, age seven, in search of the truth behind the less scientific afflictions. This incident spurned, I, of course, chose to follow the trail of this mysterious little girl. Those who have seen the infamous newspaper photos accompanying the story may remember Sachiko best as the girl with the strikingly unusual red dress. It's hard not to feel sympathy for someone who's full force to watch other children her age being tortured and killed one by one. And certainly, if I were to find Miss Shinozaki and secure an interview, that'd be the bee's knees. There'd be some real moral concerns about digging up some pain. I finally get that raise. <laughs> but then again, she's been a full-grown-ass woman, and hopefully well-adjusted adult for over ten years at this point. I hope she's hot, too. Ooh. Wait a second. Oh. By now... <laughs> oh, hi, Jordan. By now, she should be able to look back up on these sort of events with some objectivity and give more thorough account of what happened that day. I thought I'd turn those banners off. No, they're back. Oh! Whoa, I, I just had the I was weirdest supposed dream. to read that. Please, please, cheddar. What? I'm impressed, Shinazaki. You're far stronger than I thought. Totally fearless. <coughs> In fact, wasn't I the one there when we started this cutscene? <laughs> yeah. I was scared out of my mind. My brain is still struggling.
struggling to make sense of all this. Uh, okay, but look, the ghost is gone, I guess. We really managed to appease it. Uh, are, are you alright? I'm the ghost now. Damn it. You should probably dry your tears and blow your nose at least. Here's my underpants. Things aren't dry. Whoa, that was weird. Oh, fuck? What the hell? Not on my shirt. Ha ha ha. Didn't I tell you before that you shouldn't say things like that? Fine, what the... AG double hockey sticks? Not my shirt. What are you... Two? What are you, two? That confused me. <laughs> Ugh, that's really gross. Not good. She's not normally like this. Shinazaki. Okay. Oh, she's reverting to childlike thing like Hodor. Oh, okay. She become a child. She got she's got the child in her. She's got the child in she her. She got that dog in her. <laughs> <laughs> Where the fuck are we going now? I you don't tell know. Me what to do. Maybe we should go here. Go just... to the red room. Oh. Oh. I can't go this way. Oh, that's right. It's a stupid thing that I don't like seeing. Then you wait here. Well, he's sleeping. I know just what you mean. God damn it. Why did she have to die like that? Oh, yeah. She got fucking, like, hyper slammed into the wall up there. Mm-hmm. Or we think. Boo, 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 Someone could have just, boo, boo, like, boo, boo. I don't know, spilled their pizza Lunchable. That's true. Things come with a lot of more sauce than you need for those <laughs> tiny little breads. Oh way. my god. I don't like this way either. I'm gonna leave your ass behind. You don't let me do anything I wanna do. It's just like where I ask if I ask where you wanna eat. Right. You don't say <laughs> that. You just tell them you're taking them to their favorite place and hope to God they actually say what their favorite place is. There you go. Oh. Yeah, go to the red go to the red room, the room of red. Or you just tell them guess and then when they go, uh this place, you're like, yeah, wow, first wow. try. How'd you know? Or just fucking go. Yeah. Hey, look, there it is. Is it unlocked now? Nope. No. Curse That's kind you. of what I was hoping. It was like, oh, did do the thing. Go to the thing. I still have the doll, though. You do still have the doll. But I have the doll. You gotta give Hi, it Tom. to Hammer Joe. Oh, that's right. But I don't know where Hammer Joe is. I don't know where Hammer Joe is. I thought he would be in the room watching reruns on VHS. Yeah, but we're in the other... This is the other... Right, the other realm. The other realm, yeah. This is the fucking... Oh, you just had to walk up and down. Of course. Giggle. No, that's just your doll. Yeah, it is the doll. Making us a heckin' scare. I don't... Oh. No. Got to where the floor collapsed, but then... One step rooster, ten spaces red. One step rooster is north. No, rooster's. One step. Rooster was left. Rat was twelve. So one left up, and then In up here? twelve. No, it said where the floor collapsed and then repaired. So like, that's there's been so many fun right fucking instances of that. Well, yeah, that's true. We fixed the floor in some places. Oh, shit! You fucking Jesus. Christ! Whoa! Is that not where you need to go? I don't know, maybe. Suck my ass. Oh. No, there's no floor here. I thought, no. you, I thought you pushed a thing over here. Mm. A, 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 the strong guy that pushed shit. No, that was... Uh, that's That was in the other building that I'm not allowed to go oh. to now. Okay. I got a juke eyeball girl real quick. Thank you. What's she doing here? I don't know. Fucking fapping about. We gotta find her eye. Oh. I don't know. I don't know where you're going. Now. Where the floor was broken and then fixed. So let's go. I mean, they're in that's, the first hallway. That's lots of places. Yeah. Yeah. The first hallway and then one step rooster Closer four to the steps edge. back. That was that not. One? Yes, right here. So, what that's, was it? That's not it. It can't be it because be. the first thing was left, and it was and it was one step, and then yeah, unless it was like I can do this. No. Okay, go up. Wasn't there another one up here? 
No, oh, I don't know. This might be one we have to look up. I'm just gonna keep mashing and. The f where where the, the floor, floor was floor broken? Was, oops. Am I allowed to go up here yet? But now it's fixed. Nope. Do 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 do. I I feel like we fixed like multiple like multiple times. Multiple floors. Kind of what I thought. No. Nope. Oh. Either way, I don't remember what she said now. Or what it How many? What the doll said. Yeah. It, it was... was one left and then twelve up. Oh. Okay. Well you can't move at all on that one down here. So it can't possibly can't... be that. No. And even if it was, it would be like in here somewhere. Right. And that's it's not there. All right, time for a walk up, look up again. I'm just gonna keep exploring. Doing a heck and explore. Yeah. Let's just look for more floor fixes. Yeah, well, because it could have been a situation where like the floor gave out, and then like we teleported to a better place at the floor. It might not even have been a plank, you know? Right. You know what I mean, Jelly Bean? Uh, the dog will chime in, telling you a clue. Or was it in shoe room? Is that what it was trying to tell me? Shoe room. The boy return it. No, can't go that way still. I'm gonna check out shoe room, even though it's dark in there. Okay. No, uh, cause there's no floor there. Oh, you got it. Okay, we're Broken past this. Floor, I mean. The custodian key. There's a bunch of broken shit. I'm probably not allowed to oh. go up oh. here. That's right. Oh, here we go. Okay. There's only so many places I could go, so. Uh, pants, pants. Oh, the location it's referring to is the place where the floor repaired itself in the stairway between classroom 1A and 1F West Hall. Okay, so go back to the 1A area. Yep. That was, it repaired itself. Yeah. Between, between 1A and the 1F West Hall. Is this 1F? Yeah. Okay. So, so this is the stairwell. Through the, oh, got it. Okay. The cap seems to eventually close up on its own. It feels completely solid. Okay. okay. That's not it then. Okay, no. Uh, oh, I, that's not it. Move one left and then 12 up, right? I don't think so. I mean, you can try it. Yeah, one, one, two, three, four. Five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven. Oh, yeah, it is there. Yep. Okay. So we were close. Yeah. I just, we were going from that instead yeah. of, yeah. Slightly raised, peering through the crag, barely making something shiny in the dark recess below. Try to pull it out. Yes. Woohoo. You were in the master sword. <laughs> Shuffle. Shuffle. From beneath the floorboards, you manage to fish out a crank-like key that resembles the winder from an old-fashioned pocket watch. I know where that goes. What the heck is this? Doesn't look like it would fit any door I know. Oh shit! It's an anal plug. Winder. <laughs> right? Am I right? It, it's going in that one room, well, it's right? It's gotta go in that thing we found now, right? Yeah, the the crank thingy. Yeah, the crankshaft up here. Next to the two Kuyorpses. Because what the fuck else would it be? There's uh, nothing else to I don't know. The last with. time one of those things opened a door. Yeah, I know. The wonder you found looks like it'll fit yes. perfectly in the hole. Bloop, doop, doop. It did indeed slip into the device <laughs> without any trouble. But nothing happened! Maybe try turning it. Ah! Oh, come on! I give up. Fuck this! Ever still stuck seems to have a bit more give than it did before. There's a space for it to go down one more notch. Try forcing it. That sounds like a great idea. Yes. Fuck, I broke it. God. Okay. That's just like, what? I could have walked away right there. Hot damn. Sweet. What did that do? I didn't see it. Those guys <laughs> out there saw it, though. Right, yeah. This is... I'm just going to assume that something happened. <laughs> Fucking... Okay. Did it. Check We're out my so sweet, smart. Check out my sweet red goatee. <laughs> do, 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 I should save. Yeah, maybe. It's... 
Just go. I mean, we're just going. We're just I'm going. stuck on the stairs. We okay. Just got to walk around the stairwell. I just faffed it about a bit. Yay! You found death. Oh, look, it's finally we can pee forever. Wow. Oh, wow. Get a load of this place. It's got showers and everything. Oh, my God. It's a perfect place to pee poop. <laughs> eh. Let's drink all the water and puke and die. Nick, I don't want to be here either. It hurts, it hurts. It's Tom. Tom's back. Are you carrying the kid in you or something? Should I be moving? No. What's happening? Oh, no! Blood! Shinozaki! Are you alright? Did you feel something again? Are you becoming a woman? For me, perhaps? We're sorry. Another nosebleed. That's because I'm so fucking hot. If it was just her nose, it's fine. But if a big blood vessel burst in her brain or something... Well, she'd already be dead. Here, Shinozaki. Stuff some tissues up your nose to stop the bleeding. Where'd you get those? Why do you guys always just have random things? Sneeple thinks I have some of my own. But since you got yours out already... Good thing we're in Japan and people just hand out packets of tissues. <laughs> yeah, go ahead. Did the ghost get to her? No, she's been a little off since before that. I think she probably reached her limit. She needs to rest. Hmm. Oh. I'm fine, actually. Oh, no! Luigi? <laughs> hey, bro. <laughs> <laughs> it's blood from a Yumi's nose. Cool. Piss bucket number two! Yeah, discarded underwear. Oh, sweet! Just twist it up like wrong out dish rags. I'm gonna take this home. I'm gonna give it a sneeze. Of course, I'm going to give it a sneeze. All right. Go look at that locker that Luigi went into. Uh, it was, like, the, the locker is empty. empty. The locker has a Luigi in There's it. There's no Ouija in here. Uh, oh, I got you. <laughs> <laughs> now I am the boo. <laughs> Will you be mine? <laughs> <laughs> oh. Cool. Uh, you're on the roof. There's water up here. Sweet. Yeah. Essentially, it oversized faucet or pop off is used for filling the pool. Pool? Entire surface There's a pool in. here! <laughs> Yay! <laughs> Ghost pool! Ultra shiny shine. Someone's definitely not drowning in that. No running by the pool. Adult swim. Oh, oh, he's running by the pool! Don't run! I didn't do that. Game made me do it. A pool, huh? Can't even see the other side of it what, with all the rain and all. I've got rain blindness. Chibi, <laughs> chibi. Okay, then. All right, here goes. Shinozaki pushes her in. Shinozaki, this clearly isn't working. Why don't you, I, why don't I take the doll for a bit? Why don't you go for a swim? What is it like? The ring? The one ring? Maybe? You'll catch your death of cold out here. Go back inside where you can catch your death of other natural causes. <laughs> of shadow monsters. I can handle the search. You just wait for me in the locker room where we saw a ghost. That's probably a good yeah, idea. Yeah, what the... <laughs> hey, what's gonna happen if a ghost shows up again? Hmm? Do you... Did you think this through, you fuck? <laughs> think I'll be able to handle it? I mean, what have you been doing to help? Don't worry about me. If anything happens, I'll call you. And you can come to my rescue. Yeah, the main character stole all our phones, so I don't. You can't call yeah. me. Oh, this seems like a very stupid idea, but all right, just don't do anything stupid. Are you gonna do something stupid? <laughs> Thank you. What? You say something? Mm. They said two things if I match it into one. I've got to try to lighten her load as much as possible. I don't think she can handle much more of this. Okay, then. That's why I sent that crazy bitch away, so she can get kidnapped or killed. Right, this seems like a bad idea. One of them's dying, right? One of them's drowning in the pool. Is that even a pool? It, yeah. It looks like a bunch of shit in there. Well, they said it was like covered in moss and oh, fucking shit. Oh, okay. There's a sign on the door that says pump room. Hot. Same signs on my bedroom. The door is <laughs> locked. <laughs> There's a note. What's up with this murky water? There's no telling what could be down there. Poop. All I know is, I wouldn't be caught dead in this pool. Is that foreshadowing? Of course I can't really swim. Yes. That's, that's foreshadowing, isn't it? Oh, there is a note here. Look at you. Caution! Confirm all services if I get in the pool before draining. I can't drain. Maybe I can 
turn that. You could drown yourself in the pump room. <laughs> God, oh, oh, hey, hey, a purple. It looks like there's a purple lodged in the crack between two tiles. Try to dig it out. Yes. Oh, fuck my hair. Ah, I fell in the pool. Pump room key. Found near the pool. It's thin. Pump room, huh? I think I've read that somewhere before. I can enough. Huh? You got two minutes. What's that? <gasps> no, there's no way. Is it the mythical capybara? Come on, give me a break here. It's down in the pump room. Unlock it. Nope, you were supposed to go after Ayumi. <laughs> It instantly breaks. What in the Resident Evil is this? Oh, no. What do you gotta do? I don't fucking know. You gotta drain the pool. You gotta drain the pool, Lulu. Drainage. Yes. Is that it? You did it already. Yeah, the timer stopped. Whew. Well, that was not as hard as I thought it would be. Though the game made it seem like you're supposed to go the other way, but I just got that key, so... Oh, no, it's still going. Something gets stuck in the drain. Did you just catch a ghost in the drain? What? Fuck, shit, fuck. No, the timer oh, stopped Oh, the timer again. did stop. Okay. What? What's happening? Where'd the door go? There it is. Okay. You did it! Ah! Yeah! You found some corpses. Cool. I guess. This is a mistake. Gasp. Oh my god! Oh no. No. Shinazaki. That Shinazaki, I can tell by the thighs. Why? Why did this have to happen? God. No. No. Shinazaki. No. Could I have prevented that if I didn't drain it? I probably. Ah, did you get a bad end? Maybe you got a bad end. Possibly. Maybe I wasn't supposed to drain it. <laughs> yep, that's a bad end. I wasn't supposed to drain it. Were you supposed to go do go after Ayumi instead? Maybe. Or okay then. Do the other pump. Son of a bitch. I, yeah, I don't know. Let's see. Oh, I'm, I'm gonna read. Okay. Oh. Okay, thank you. Alrighty then. I mean, that seemed like what you were supposed to do. Yeah, that's what it's fucking... It's, it's a trickery boy. They did a, they did a heckin' trickery. Oh, uh, you gotta go all the way back here now? I could skip. It's fine. Yeah, give it. Give it, you fuck. No, you gotta go learn about it first. Nah. -uh. The doll has to tell you about -uh. it first. Are you fucking? Is this where how far back I was? I could have sworn I saved it. I think no. You saved after you found it, didn't you? I thought. And put it in. Yeah. Yes. This is me going to the fucking the thing. Yeah. You got the fucking thing. The thing. The door open. The the wall opened already. Right. Oh, thank God. Yes. That would have been terrible if yeah. you had to like skip, 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 learn skip, about skip, it. Skip, first. Ah, it hurts! It hurts! Luigi. Luigi. And then we go this way. Oh, just standing on grates. Okay. I bet I gotta run to this. Oh. oh, oh, oh. Let's split up for some reason. So I could kill someone with the pool. No, no running, running by, by the, the pool. Okay. Go down here, and then you'll find a purple. Yeah, I gotta check the gate, then there's a purple. Because this says don't drain it when someone's in there. So, like, someone was in there, and I drained it. <laughs> Way to go. Confirm everyone's left the pool before doing the Mohinder. Yeah, you doof. <laughs> Pump room. Now I can go get the perp. Oh, you bypassed the perp. Ha ah, ha! Okay. Who's that? No, I believe that board. No, no. Probably. Yeah. Go, go in the pool and go to where that ripple is. Go in the pool? Yeah. He can't swim. He can't? No. He said. Oh, oh well, then go check if room. she's in the. Yeah. Yep. Just 
He's got to overcome his fears, doesn't he? He's going to have to... Like she's in the pool. Yeah. Shinozaki! Yeah, she came after you. Yeah, she fell in the pool, so the, and I drained it and fucking killed her. Yeah, good job. Damn it, she's not here. What the hell is she thinking? Oh. Okay, back to the pool. Poopy butt sniff. <laughs> What is wrong with me? What am I doing? I never should have taken my eyes off of her. Yeah, you think? This is all my fault. God damn it. Nope. Okay. I mean, I'm going to have to swim. I can't drain it. Shinazaki. Shinazaki. Oh, I, it's, you know what? It's actually not that deep. It was, well, the ripple was up there. Like, right there okay pretty sure this is where the waves were coming from oh, it is maybe not and you die <laughs> i thought it was up one. Oh, you fuck yeah try up one luckily you didn't die she's not here did i pick the wrong spot it was like here somewhere God, you're running out of time. Yeah, we can't Fuck. like read. We have to just, I have to skip dialogue, which is stupid because. It's her. There it is. Don't worry, Shinozaki, I'm pulling you up. Whew, thank God. Wow, you don't get much time. No. Shinozaki. Shinozaki. Good. At least she's still got a pulse. Phew, 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 phew. I don't know how to do this. <laughs> Come on, I breathe already, damn it. I've shoo shooed you. Heck, Spatty. Uh, you kissed me. Ha <laughs> ha. You got cooties now. Cough, cough, cough. Gaps, cough. Cough, cough, wheeze. <laughs> Deep sigh. <laughs> God, don't worry me like that. Well, don't fucking split up with me, you I just wanted to swim a little bit. You back with me now? Yeah. So tell me, why the hell did you jump into the pool? I slipped. Pan Pan, you called me out there, didn't you? I, what? I heard your voice, so I ran outside. And after that, I don't remember much else. The next thing I knew, my vision was all this sickening green color and my mouth was full of water. God damn it! <laughs> was this the work of one of them ghosts again? Can't believe they can trick us so easily. I'm gonna put my foot up their ass. There's gotta be something in that pool. Ewok! Ewok in my tooth. Oh god, it's like ouchie or something. <laughs> Wonder if the showers still work. Oh, this could be hot. What the? Yeah, oh, poo poo. Try this one. Ah! <laughs> Pipe's not even connected to that one. Nothing. Maybe if you drain the pool. I can't get rid of this terrible taste, and I smell absolutely putrid. I hate this. I don't care about all the corpses. Now I smell bad, so I'm gonna die. Yay! Sorry, I just got ESPN news. Okay. And I'm excited. Okay. <laughs> you sound excited. Yay! What's up? How does she think I feel? Should she fucking. I'm the one who has to smell her dirty ass. <laughs> Shinozaki, how about we go out into the rain and wash ourselves off a little? There's panties in that bucket. Let's use some of those. So I don't know how much help rainwater will be for getting that taste out of your mouth. I mean, it, it, it'll it work, probably. And yeah, you could at least, like, gargle and Sniffle. swoosh. Okay. All right, then. Let's go. Okay. <laughs> After this, I guess we'll need to figure out how to dry our cloths. We're going to have to be naked. Oh, dear. We're going to have to be naked and huddle up for warmth. Feeling better? No. No, I eat a poop. <laughs> yeah, surprisingly, I was able to rinse out my mouth pretty thoroughly. See? That was ghost rain, though. No, were you? That's 
good. So, Shinozaki, while I was out here, I came across a room in the back that I kind of like to check out. You wait here. <laughs> I'll go with you. No. That's probably for the best. In fact, we shouldn't have split up in the first place. Let's do it. These people are like too much... Like, something bad just happened in this room that I'm right next to. Let's split up. Right, yeah. <laughs> let's... It's not like you're new here. <laughs> yeah, everything is bad. Stay together, dumbasses. Okay, so now what? Do you, now do you drain now the Now I drain because there's no one in there. You still haven't saved in a while. Shut up. It's fine. It's pretty scary. There were other Kiorpses in there. Though. Explosion, yeah, but they're already dead, so fucking let them get chopped up. It seemed like I had more of a reaction than the first time. Maybe. Yay! There's no corpse no, no corpse in, in the, the middle. middle. Yeah. <laughs> At first I was like, who's Shinozaki again? I did I don't know their names either. I was like, which one is that? It's the body of a female student. It's Mitsuki. How do I get to that note? Oh, right. Like that. <laughs> <laughs> I removed the wheel from the water pump and threw it into the pool. So that's what I need. Hopefully that'll keep anyone from finding the little treasure I left in the spigot. <laughs> it's poop. Oh no. That bitch killed my friends. She can spend eternity without a tongue for all I care. Another tongue? A fucking tongue. Or just a tongue serial killer guy. Based on size, it appears to be the body of a high schooler. Long term exposure to the dirty kidnapped while has left it quite a mess. Hirune Tanaka. It's the body of a female student rotting into decade. Tsukasa! 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 The corpse very tiny individual being pickled in the filthy brine for so long seems to have bloated its skin like a patchwork of pustules. That sounds delicious. That's some nice alliteration. Right? Was this one? Did I already click on this one? Yes. My cat is clicking. Did you hear that? Yeah. Essentially, the notice faucet or pump. Its higher surface is covered in moss. Okay, so I can't. Okay, so what do you do now then? Go back into the... the, the oh, wait. Into he the... said there was a thing in the pool I needed to grab. Oh. Oh, in the middle? Maybe. Or probably maybe in the this? middle. No, probably in the middle. Nope. Hang on. No. Oh! oh. Try to fish it out? Sure! Yeah. You've got tongue. What is this thing? Some kind of handle? Some kind of Hey, handle. a rusted valve wheel! This is fun. I like this game. This is a little more puzzly, I guess. It's just... It's just when you get into a wandering section. And it's like... Ugh. Well, it's not even just when I get to a wandering section. It's when the character is like, I should go here, yeah, and then that's not the place I should that, go. That way threw us off. <laughs> Obviously, we're for living in the poo poo lulu. Is that not where you I probably got to put it in the drain room. Okay, or back. the locker room. Maybe. Let's right. go check it out. Before what I walk all the Luigi way around. Luigi ghost? I don't fucking know. Here you go. Does it go to one of these? No. Okay. Yeah, I need to go back to the pump room. It's dark in there. There's probably another valve to, like, refill yeah. it or something. This or... thing's missing a turny, turny, turny. Yeah. Yeah. A turny at long. Just going to let it, me sit on that dirty, terrible joke. You doing that to me right now? I thought it was great. God damn you. You fuck. <laughs> I quit. You suck and you're stupid. Uh, thank you. You're welcome. I'm thirsty. I'm going to drink some delicious crisp Pepsi Zero Sugar. Gross. What? I don't like Pepsi. Oh, I love Pepsi. It's okay. It's just, it's not my, my first choice. Are you a Coke person? I am a Coke person. Oh, God. Have you tried the uh, the new spiced one? No, I have not. It's not bad. They have a zero sugar of it, so of course I tried it. Yeah. I mean, yeah, I don't try it at some point it's like i think they i looked it up and it was like oh. a spiced raspberry or something flavor like it oh. sounded weird but yeah, it, it sound was bad good. i found it okay this obviously can't you see this is where you're supposed to click i can see where you would put the rusted valve wheel shit it's rusted Ugh, that's as far as it's gonna go i think too rusted to turn anymore. Okay. Okay. Can you turn it then? Or is, are you done? I think he already did it. Oh. Let me out. <laughs> okay. Oh, 
Okay. What did the what did that do? I think that turned on the water. Oh, there's a purple again. Yeah. There's a small hemp bag stemmed with copious amounts of blood. It has to fall in front of the spigot. It's got the, oh okay. Yeah, it's another the, tongue. Another tongue. Tokiko. Tokiko. The bag of can do a human tongue. Oh God, fuck! I never get used to this. Well, they didn't do the first. Oh yeah, they did do the first it's one. It's a girl's name. No, oh, that's it's a tongue. <laughs> Oh god, I'm holding a girl's tongue. Oh, it's so hot. Fucking. Okay, now he's just gotta weird. find another We're ghost. Collecting tongues now? Oh wait, eyeless girl. Does she need a tongue? I guess. Or is oh They must all need a tongue. They all they all need tongue on this glorious day. Of course. You wanna look at your blood real quick? It's cool. blood. There's Bye. some blood from your nose. What was Luigi doing? I don't know. Why was Luigi there? I don't know either. Where was Oh wait, go talk to it. Maybe he needs the tongue. <laughs> Luigi? Yeah. He's not he's not there though. Are you sure? Now we that you have a tongue you might been be. Been there multiple times. What was that then? This is Luigi. Go talk to him. He's not there. Oh fuck, fine. Was that just there to give you a heckin' spook? I don't know, it's fucking Luigi. Where was Eyeless Are Girl? Are you really gonna let you, you probably find a save before you let Eyeless Girl touch You're you? You're right. <laughs> just in case that's not what you need to do. Cause she's, it seems way. like she's missing an eyeball, not a tongue. Yeah. This guy walks like fucking boss baby. <laughs> this fucking pudgy gut sticking out in front of him. Yeah. I'm boss baby. I don't know what boss bitch. baby walks like, but just that's like the first thing I think of is like a baby strutting around with a fucking baby gut sticking out. Yeah, and a tuxedo. Yeah. I don't... I've never actually saw i saw like i think it was like the third one there's no third one i don't even think there's a second one well then maybe it was a second one and i don't think there's a second one well there definitely was really are you there, oh well there was a show like back in business or something yeah that was a sh that was there was a netflix no, show it was the movie i went to the movie there was a second movie yeah i think there was sure? a, i think there was a third movie because i think i saw the third movie you're crazy i could swear there's only one movie Oh, there's two of them. Well, she's missing an eye, so I would... Uh oh, Oh, but she has no fucking head. Yeah, but she's got a... Here, have your... Boss it's... Baby Movies. Oh, God. Yeah, see, she needs a tongue. And just, just look, you just kind of, like, drop it in there. I look, look, look. <laughs> yeah. She's got no head above her chin. Okay. Gurgle, gurgle. <laughs> oh. Okay, it was the second one. There is a third one coming. Oh, I didn't know Boss there was Baby, even a second one. And then Boss Baby Family Business. That's what I saw. Oh, I didn't know that was a thing. <laughs> Pull out the tongue bag? Yeah, I'm going to try the headless girl. Just drop the tongue bag. Because the other one's got to be the eyeball, right? Yeah. The little girl's spirit is staggering toward a Yumi blood gushing up from her gaping cross section of head as she walks. Oh, God. Oh, please be the right one. Tokiko Suji! Come on down! You're the next contestant, I'm Get the tongue the fuck away from me! This is yours, isn't it? I'm giving it back! I couldn't find the rest of your head, sorry. You offered the spirit the tongue. <gasps> Sputter cough cough. Yay, I can lick. I think I was right! Well, what happened? The other ghost is headed this way! We have to run! Okay. Okay. Where? I don't know. Well... Let's boss baby our way out of here. <laughs> well, you can't tell by the way I use my walk. I gotta load in my pants. No time to talk. <laughs> pants, 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 pants. You got some new underpants and you got pants all over. I think yeah. it'll be fine. All right. That's cool, I guess. Now what? I don't fucking know. Go talk to the eyeless ghost. That's a terrible idea. Nah, you just saved. All right, fine. Should may kill you, but then you get an extra ending. That's true. I hate when it does that. Sometimes it just like stops me when I after I take one step in a room. So I'm like, oh, cutscene. Yeah, nope. something's about to happen. Well, I don't. She did say you have to run, didn't she? Yeah, but you said so. We're doing it. All right. Yeah, just go see what she wants. Probably wants an eyeball. Oh, baby, we don't got well, an eye for okay, you. Maybe I wouldn't. <laughs> Tom, help me. Okay, fine. Fuck off. What do we know. do now? You go back to one A. We go to the custodian room. I don't have the key to the custodian room. Damn it. 
Where's the last? I need one more body part. Yeah, you need an eyeball somewhere. Ooh. Probably. Oh, shit, she touched you. Oh, shit, it was her tongue. Oh, maybe it is. Get it back. Get it back. She doesn't have a tongue. Does she? That's a, that's a no tongue, right? But she also doesn't have an eye. Yeah. Begin slowly expanding in size. Wah. Damn it. Glue, 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 I can't. Now it's done. Okay. Move my body. Damn it. All right. Well, whatever. Oh, sorry. No, we'd probably just need another tongue. And we have I guess. Another... I, I wonder if that staircase... Yeah, this is the fucking face that you can kind of see. Yeah, okay, I don't need this. Oh, whatever. Uh, that probably doesn't count as a different ending, then. Mm, I don't know, because it, the well, first time it happened, it wasn't her. Like, it didn't true. show got, that face. You got a picture. You got a different CG. Well, whatever. Okay. I mean, you just thumbnail. saved, so who cares? Yeah. Once the game actually lets I me know. go back to Jesus the menu. Christ. <laughs> Yay! Okay. Are we at an episode? Or are we... No. Okay, you keep saying okay like it's like a wrap-up kind of okay. All okay. right. Well, next time. All right. We will continue playing right now. Yes. Uh, was it here? No, it was up here. I'm going to try that staircase that okay. has the... Oh, the force of field of yes, knowledge? Yes, uh, because the only place... Back. It's the only place I'm not allowed to go. Well, that and the custodian, but that's because the other people are in the custodian thing with right. the key. Chapters are getting convoluted, right? Nope. Ah, Jesus. Nope. Okay. Well, so now where do you go? Maybe push past her, and there's something up there for me. Maybe. I don't know. They didn't say. They're just like, she's coming for us. Run. Right. But there's this very specific place it wants me to run. But guess what? It's not going to tell me where. Maybe the shoe room, because that's at the bottom of that hallway. Yeah. I, I ran know. to the I'm, safe point. I'm just gonna. I'm gonna look it up. Do, 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 I accidentally do, do. closed it. Now watch, I saved after giving the tongue to the wrong ghost yeah, or something, you, and it... You completely screwed yourself. I fucked up the sequence. I doubt it. I feel like if I would have given it to the wrong one, they would have fucking instant yeah, made me lose. But she needed a tongue, too. It probably doesn't matter. Maybe not. Like, no matter which one you give it to, the other one starts to chase you. You know what I mean? Right. Okay, where are we? Uh... Okay, here we go. Check on you mean she's no longer in the locker room. I'm gonna go to the pump room, the red pump. If you did, climb into the pool. Check a bit. Hey, I did a thing. You did a thing. Yep, red dress girl just ran down here. Oh, nice. Okay. She's leading the way. Oh. Weep weep. Here we go again. Ah. Roll credits. Where the hell's it gonna take us this time? It's weep, weep. pointing at your butthole. No, not my butthole. <laughs> where your friend was splattered. Oh, well, I know where that is. The floor boards beneath that wall. The fuck? Right under her so we have globby entrails. Fucking dig through the corpse. This way. Oh, uh, fuck. Come on, camera. Cooperate with me. Fuck. Where the floor dips and the drip, dip, drop, drip, dip, drip, drop. Drippy, drippy, drop, blood, blood, sticky, icky. Get in there, good, and... Dig it out! <laughs> this is fun! Little bitch. No! I threw up a... Jesus Christ. You're getting a good laugh out of this, you sick son of a bitch. Yeah. <laughs> God, if that's where it is. Uh, I'm not sure we could ever bring ourselves to get it. Don't be a puss. <laughs> <laughs> Sis or death. Is someone there? Oh, is that? That's not the doll. I don't Probably know you. The... Oh, it's that it's guy. Nerd man. I don't remember his voice. I don't know. Yeah. Yeah, I probably think. Kenji. Morishige, you're alive. Uh, yeah, Kishinuma and our class rep. I'm very glad to see you both safe and sound. I told you to stop doing that. <laughs> what happened? It's a long story. So where have you been? 
Yeah, I was in the second wing until a short while ago, but suddenly lost consciousness. And when I woke up here, it felt as if the air had somehow changed. The plot needed me here, so it brought me here. Oh, yes, and I did briefly cross paths with Mochita and his sister. You, you, you did? Sir, they're okay too? No, uh, they are. I don't know what I went to next. When I next ran into Mochita's sister, it seemed she and her brother had parted ways. So you're saying she's single? What is that in your hand? Oh! Marushika appears to be grasping a blood soaked pouch, pouch, pouch in his hand. Oh, he got the tongue for it. Oh, cool. nice! Mm, oh, this thing. You found it under the floorboards in the hallway so you guys wouldn't have to. I was humping the, you, you, some guts. You're what? Just up these stairs. Is it some kind of charm? Do you fucking want it? <laughs> Come get it. No, please take it. I'm merely searching for a certain someone, so I have no need for charms at the present time. Yay, we got a Yay, tongue again. A Thai girl. Probably. Uh, so student. I never tiger with that type of Yuki! Yuki-chano. Well, I should be going now. Something wrong, class rep? You look like you've seen a ghost. Who's <laughs> 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 uh, I guess one more thing. Mochita said we should all try to meet in class. You want a? You know the place. <laughs> <laughs> uh, okay. All right. You don't have to go look through the corpses. Yay! I'm guessing. It wasn't from, you know, Suzumoto's spot. Maybe it shifted over a few feet, and he got it from there. Uh, I mean, if he didn't, then... That really freaked me out. Did you see his hands? They were covered in blood. 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 Uh. Alright. I mean... Okay. Cool. Whatever. Saves me the walk, I guess. Does it? Or do you need to still go do it? No. I got the tongue. All I just right. gotta go find Eye Girl. I should probably go save first though, right? Yeah, in case she kills you again? Right. It's a possibility. Because the tongue could be for like wow. the girl in the red dress, possibly. Maybe? But the girl in the red dress seems to be the one that survived. Yeah, I don't know. Plus, when the girl caught you last time, she did say give it back. Yeah. So. I really thought I would need to, like, give her an eyeball. You know, because she's missing an eye. But yeah. I guess he just cut the tongues out of all of them. Right. I mean, the other one was missing Like, that's a the head shit in the just... infirmary that had, like... Well, that was him, like, continuing, like, trying to, like, practice or something. And he, like, fucked up. Yeah, yeah. One of the notes went into, like, more detail. I don't remember the... Exactly. Here you go. Hey, babe. Get it back. Get it back. Push him back. Push him back. Way back. This girl's missing an eye. This girl's missing an eye. All we've got is a tongue. Is that going to be enough? What do we do? I mean, the other girl didn't have a head, so. Oh, it's a tongue bag. Yeah. This isn't enough. Pants, pants, hick, sob, cry. You hand her the tongue. She stuffs it in her eye socket. Yeah, that's great. The girl lowers her head and gets rocking back and forth. Yuki? Kano? <gasps> this is for you. It is yours, isn't it? I don't know. Would you know your tongue if you saw it? Would you be able to pick your tongue out of a lineup? Uh, possibly. Mine's pretty <laughs> wide. Blip. Girl spirit. <laughs> yeah, girl spirit. <laughs> Han you. Well, Han yourself. Thank you very much. Oh, look at a big old frown. She said. Bye. Pant. Oh. Pant. Pant. Pant, pant, heck. We, we did it, Shinozaki. All three of them. All that's left is the girl in the red. No! No more. 
Ghost. Would you chill the fuck? We're almost done at this point. Fucking God. Every time I talk to these ghosts, I feel like I'm getting closer and closer to death myself. Oh, well, that's a sacrifice I'm willing to make. Do you have any idea what that's like? I keep picturing how I'll look when I'm dead. I mean, hot as fuck, but I'm not even trying. It just pops into my head all of a sudden, and it's such a horrible image. I want to go home. I just want to go home, back to my mom and my sister and Mojita. Okay. Oh, friend zoned even in the afterlife? <laughs> Fuck you. Shinozaki. All right, next one is mine then, okay? So just try to pull yourself to get- Whoa! Oh, fuck, ah, oh, Jesus, my leg. How long has that window been there? God damn it, not again. This one's big, too. What the, what is happening? Oh my God, the book's turning. Uh... Oh. 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 Ouija. <laughs> it is Ouija. Oh God. There's a... No, that's that shadow thing. Yep. Escaped from the book again. Um. Timer's still going, so... Oh, off was I knocked out. Where am I? I don't know why I voice Why are you a there. monster now? Oh, I'm fine, actually. Is this <gasps> where... Hey, look! Main guy ended up that one time? Yeah. Did we swap to the other world? You may have passed between worlds. We're gonna run into Mochita now? Uh, is this our classroom? No fooling? No cap, bro? <laughs> <laughs> Odd God? Shinazaki! Hey, wake up! Uh, she's breathing at least. Gotta breath stinks. She still smells like algae. Shinozaki, come on, wake up already. Ing. Five more minutes. Kiki, Numa. Maya he. Sorry. Maya he. Let's take it to Numa Numa. Hick, hack off. Pant, pant one. <laughs> Take a look around you. I can hardly believe it myself, but here we are. No way! We were too good at the game, so the spirits kicked us out. <laughs> yeah, well, we're back? A dinosaur story? For real? Is this... How uh, dare you? We're not allowed to make that joke anymore. Is this really our school? It's really real reels. Check it out. Here's my desk. I left my gum under here and everything. It's still fresh. We bussin' for real, for real. <laughs> Mine too. It's right here. I can't believe it. Can you please stop talking like that? It's true. <laughs> yeah, we made it. We're home. We're home. Fuck yeah. <laughs> Suck on that world. This is definitely not real. That's when the bombs dropped. <laughs> <laughs> Hiroshima, 1945, or whatever fucking year it was. Okay, then. That was fun, I guess. I never thought I'd live to see home again. Um, oh. Oh, oh, oh. Well, uh, guess there's no Satoshi or Miss Yui or anyone else, huh? Now, don't be stupid and think you gotta go back for people. They can fucking handle it on their own. Go home. Time this to leave. Is, this is not... Guess there's no Satoshi... Venturing out in search of others, you find that even the janitor has likely gone home. The lights are out, and the halls are pitch black. Only the red glow of the light next to the fire extinguisher offers any respite from the quaint, quiet darkness of the school hallway. Standing around the darkened corridors of our school building at 8 in the evening just feels so surreal. Oh my god, it's so late. <laughs> 8 in the evening? As the thunder and rain grow in intensity, the windows begin to condense with moisture, turning white in contrast to the corridor sea of black. Uh. Is this reality? 
Was everything up until now just a dream? Yeah, totally. It was only just a dream. Where am I right now, and what am I doing? Mm-hmm. Well, Shinazaki, what's wrong? Oh, okay. my lord. What the hell is this? Damn it. What is happening? Hey guys. Who it is? It's that, that I a girl, I think. It's is it? you. It's girl spirit. Girl power. No! I hate you! You stink! Go away! Don't come any closer! A pin pin! Ah! There's no pants here. It was a rainy evening after school, just like this one. On the day I was kidnapped. I remember I had a fight with my mom that morning. Why is she telling us this? I don't fucking care. (laughs) I have no idea. I didn't want to see her face. You guys are kind of rude. So I cut my own eye out. So after school, I decided that instead of going home, I'd park myself in the outdoor walkway for a little and watch the rain. That's when Mr. Yoshizaku, Kazu, showed up. He sat down next to me. I told him all about my fight with Mom, and he listened really closely, and he just kept saying, uh-huh, uh-huh. Yeah, it's really interesting. He was sick and couldn't speak much, you see, but oh, he was a very kind man. I really liked him. But then... <laughs> uh. You two are nice people. I'm so sorry. She's so tiny. She must be... Mm, fifth grader? What are you, like two centimeters taller than her? <laughs> Yuki Kano, right? Uh, thank you for what you did back there. For making the effort to help those of us who were killed in that school. D- didn't we succeed, though? So why are you still here? And what the fuck is that? <laughs> That's my dog. <laughs> oh. No, you didn't. But we returned your tongues. What the fuck else are we supposed to do? I'm missing an eye. Oh. oh. We gave you back your ability to speak out. And we even got your murderer to repent for what he did. Is it just that you can't forgive him no matter what? I mean, why would you? Um, appeasing us isn't about forgiveness. It doesn't matter if we forgive or not. Repentance is between the criminal and the victim. It's the soul act capable of moving us. And we exist as fragments of the sacred ground upon which heavenly host is sealed. I believe that moving us is your best course of action. But it's not enough. His repentance just wasn't enough. So you're saying his words, the words spoken by the doll, weren't good enough to appease you? The fucking stupid doll. (laughs) I hate it. Um, that's not... Uh... Huh? So, what then? Game over? Why do we feel the need... Why do you feel the need to trap one as an innocent stranger after another in that godforsaken place? You bored. You child spirits are the ones who summoned us there, aren't you? I mean, you ever, you know how that, long eternity is? It's not true. The hell do you mean by that? Uh, it's false. We're just the cogs that hold the whole those places together. But you, you killed Suzumoto, didn't you? Good God, no! What kind of monster do you think I am? <laughs> That kind? Wait! Huh? Let's hear her out. 
She just got that tongue back. Let her talk. <laughs> uh, I'm just glad I was able to get even the two of you back to safety. Is it? Why the hell are you suddenly so concerned about us? I heard about the situation like this from my sister once. How convenient. A lost soul whose life was ended violently and abruptly, leaving her with a mountain of worries and regrets. It's kind of like stopping short on the edge of madness. And I'm about to break. Mm, with all sorts of thoughts and feelings swirling around in your head. Your kindly nature and your sudden hatred and panic begin to spin around and around. And you just start acting out without any sort of control. What the fuck are you talking about? <laughs> your sister is some kind of medium or something? Some kind of deus ex machina? Some kind of mid or something? <laughs> yeah, something like that. So what you're saying is this little girl and the creepy little girl we met before are two sides of the same coin? No, oh, that's kind of rude. Yeah, I'm standing right here. I feel for you. I really do. So please, please bring the rest of them back. Mochida, Miss Yui, and everyone else too. Bring them all back home. Nah. Yeah. Yeah. Come on, you can do it, right? Leave in the heart of the cards. No, I don't think that's possible anymore. Isn't the teacher dead? No, she did get back up, didn't she? Yeah, she was able to get up somehow. Why not? Uh, those closed spaces have eaten a lot of innocent souls. Far too many, in fact. The grudges of those who died there have filled every last corner of them. There's no room left. And because the agony and pain has nowhere else to go, it's begun feeding on the minds of souls like us who are bound there. It won't be long Till before I, I turn back you. into a vengeful spirit who attacks people like you without mercy. Oh, do, do, ah. <laughs> so we're gonna lose you as an ally then? Ally is a strong term. No. So why don't you just hurry up and bring them home right now? Isn't there any way for us to save Mochida and the others? There may be one way. What is it? I think you already know. You have to return to the closed spaces. Find all four of us heavenly host serial kidnapping and murder victims. And put us all to rest. Then the closed spaces won't have their cogs anymore, so they begin to fall apart. Or you just go home, because she's already confirmed that you're home. And you just might get your friends back. Nah. You expect us to go back? Fuck that. <laughs> And this time, instead of just having one person left to appease, we have to go back to the drawing board and appease all four of you? Why couldn't you tell us the reason our previous efforts weren't good enough? What is there to hide? Well, I didn't have a tongue before. <laughs> no, it's just uh, something I don't want to remember, but I like, I like spending time with you guys, okay? If you really want to know, I'll tell you. I'll tell you everything that happened. Can I save first? <laughs> Yuki's spirit gently took hold of Ayumi's hands, and in an instant their two beings seemed to merge together into a single mind. That way she could tell her through telepathy. <laughs> oh, what's going on? Oh, oh my god, your name's Violet Beauregard. <laughs> Shinozaki. Shinozaki, I mean. It hurts. It hurts. How did I let her inside? I'm dripping up sweat. Oh. I kind of like it. Uh. Huh? Okay. What happened to me? Didn't I pass out? So why am I fully aware right now? I can't see anything though. You're just standing there with your eyes closed. I can't move. It's like that feeling you get when you're really tired. Sleep paralysis, I think. Who am I saying this to? Hello? Oh, what the? Oh. Yeah. Where? Why can't I move? What the?
what the hell was that? That was the four kids. Sachiko Shinozaki, the little girl in the red dress, and the only survivor of the horrific murders that occurred in Heavenly Host Elementary School. Following the incident, Sachiko's family fled from the area, moving to another prefecture to escape the frightful memories that remained here. Strangely, however, I've been unable to locate any other records of the Shinozaki family. No matter where I look, the only information I can find about them comes from newspaper reports on the Heavenly Host murders. Granted, when an elementary school becomes the stage for a grisly incident such as this, perpetrated by none other than the principal's own son, <gasps> it stands to reason that the scandal would serve as the primary focus for public interest, with all of their details fading into the background. So, of course, after learning that Sachiko was safe, further news of her whereabouts was largely ignored in favor of the media circus surrounding the school. But there's more to it than that. People weren't just uninterested in learning of Sachiko's history or whereabouts. There was simply no data to be had. Okay, then. All right. You can't move my body because of sleep paralysis, I guess. But I can clearly see the room I'm in now. Yeah, so she's like in the place of eyeball missing girl. Seeing what happened. There's one boy and two girls in here, aside from myself. I recognize them. They're the children who were killed in a heavenly host during that incident. But they're still alive! Unfortunately, they're all bound hand and foot. And just brought out on the floor, and so am I. That's the real reason I can't move. You could roll. Weep, weep. Where? Oh, God. Oh, okay. Hi. Somebody please save me. Which one is that? No. Oh, Gasp. Ooh, ah. <laughs> What the fuck is wrong oh, with gyroid oh. man? Ew. Oh, it's Hodor. No, I can't see. Now I'm blindfolded. I can't see a thing that's happening to me. And since my hands and feet are tied up, I can't remove the blindfold either. I don't. That doesn't make sense. Yes, you can. Unless they're tied to each other. They might be tied, like, or you're to your body. Yeah. Because I was going to say, could you just, like, put, pull your hands up to the blindfold and pull it down? Yeah. They probably, like, tie it around your waist, too. Maybe. It just makes everything so much worse. This sucks. I guess because I can't see, I begin to listen more intently. Hmm. <laughs> Frightened sobbing. The helpless cries of the other children echo off the walls of the cramped room. I'm so scared. It feels like my head's going to explode. -y. What are you doing to me? Why am I blindfolded? Take this off. This is stupid. Hold on. Untie me. Cut the ropes. I want to be able to use my hands and feet. Please. Please. Come on, Ed. Nicely. <laughs> Just let me escape. Pretty please. I kept begging and pleading, but all I heard in response was the man walking away from me. In order, okay? In order? I fixed the vending machine. Great! I can get my Fruitopia! Where you get the Snickers? Ah, yeah! Yeah! That was the boy, I'm assuming? Oh, shit. Yep. I've never heard screaming like this before. It's pure primal terror cutting through the air like a perfect sine wave. It's the boy at the end. It feels like he's been screaming for an eternity. I think he's being killed right now. Jesus. My God, what the hell is he doing to him? No one deserves this. Why isn't God allowing him to fall unconscious so he doesn't have to suffer? Jesus Christ. 
Calm down, Hodor. Right? Uh. It's been at least half an hour now. Those inhuman screams of a young boy being ripped apart from the inside have finally come to a halt. Now he's going for the second one. Yeah. This is the one that gets her head fucking ripped off or whatever. Yeah. Without even a single moment of silence, the first of the girls in line is the next to scream for her life, and the symphony goes on. I'll go her mouth. <laughs> Allie. So then she. I next. assumed he would have cut the tongues out first, but I guess he didn't. But why was it like, though the tongues are the important thing when, like, he's obviously beating the fuck out of them. Yeah, and, like, <laughs> her whole head was missing. I can't take any more of this. I'm losing my mind. Stop it, stop it, stop it, stop it, stop it. <laughs> Is it still going on? Come on, just die already. You can do it. <laughs> die already? God, what is wrong with me? Hurry up. I want my turn already. You know what? I don't care. Just get it over with and leave me in peace. Uh. Finally, after hearing a sound like a heavy object being dropped, the noises stopped and the room grew quiet again. Thumpy, thumpy, thump, 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 thump. Those footsteps are getting closer. All my hair is standing on end at this point. Everything below my stomach feels like it's frozen, like I've suddenly been stricken with severe diarrhea. I did a poops. <laughs> In order, God, why am I relieved by the silence? The kid next to me just died. Which means it's my turn now. Ah! Someone's got me by the hair. They're pulling my head up. I'm taking off my blindfold, which means I get to see the face of my killer. Surprise! Happy birthday! <laughs> <laughs> what? <laughs> That's the worst surprise ever, right? Four missing children were found in a basement room at Heavenly Host Academy School, uh, used and unused and officially sealed since the building's construction. When authorities entered, they were greeted with an inhumanly horrific sight. Based upon the evidence at hand, the murder weapon was determined to be a pair of large sewing scissors found in the hand of the accused. Investigators suspected some hesitation on the man's part, however, as the deceased victim's wounds did not indicate that his full strength had been used. Nonetheless, he had clearly acted with extreme malicious intent. The official cause of death for the three murdered children had been listed as loss of blood following removal of the tongue. But the actual state of affairs was not quite so clinical, nor even so pleasant, if you can believe it. The following details have been extrapolated from information previously unrelated, unreleased to the public, or at least previously unreported by news outlets. These details of the crime are based on the official police testimony of Sachiko Shinazaki herself. Evidently, the victims were bound, blindfolded, and spaced out on the floor, then killed one by one. One was repeatedly stabbed in the abdomen with the aforementioned pair of scissors, then had many of his internal organs forcefully dug out. His discarded innards were found partially buried beneath the earthen floor on the basement of the basement room. Another was stabbed in the head dozens upon dozens of times to such an extent that all flesh and bone above her jawline was essentially minced away. With my blindfold removed. Are we ever going to get to a save point? I don't know. Is this the end of the chapter? Uh, maybe. The sight that appeared before me was more horrific than anything I could possibly have imagined. Hey, you're going to get some scissors to the eyeball. The person staring back at me, brandishing a blood-soaked pair of sewing scissors, wasn't the large man from earlier at all. It's the, it's the guy, the crazy student that's with Mochita's sister. Right? Like uh, 100%? That's the principal's son? It was one of the children! Oh. Oh, nope, that's a girl. It was a little girl. Her face dyed red with the blood of her victims. Is that the red dress girl? The survivor? She was staring intently at me with soulless gray eyes, and then... She just started giggling. I didn't think it was very funny. Snip, snip, snap, snippy, snip, snap, snap. 
Snippy, snippy, snap, snip, snip, snap, snap. You sneak in the face. Ah, uh, oh, do, do, do. Kiku, kiku. She was opening and closing the bloody scissors over and over again, and the sound kept echoing through the room. Then she took those dull, rusty, thoroughly blood soaked blades. It slowly brought them closer and closer to my left eye. Oh, yeah, too, too. Uh, the whole door or something. What is his whole? What's his deal? I don't know. Hello. Why? Why is it you? Who is you? Are you girl with red dress? Yep. Okay. So that is the survivor that got away was the murderer. No. 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 Ay, ay. This kind of hurts. You okay? <laughs> the third victim was stabbed in the left eye an indeterminate number of times. In, or an intermediate number of times, I don't know. Until her eyeball became soup-like in consistency, she was eventually just left like that, slowly bleeding to death in horrible agony. Strangely, it was only after these mutilations had already been inflicted that the killer went back and severed the victim's tongues. Learning the truth about these proceedings is shocking even to me and makes it nearly impossible to accept the murderer as anything but a monster. Unbearing witness to every moment of this was a seven-year-old girl named Sachiko. In many ways, she's the most pitiable and long-suffering of them all. But it was through her tearful, frightened testimony that Yoshiza Yoshikazu Yanagihori was officially charged. Now going back to the hunt for information on this unfortunate girl's whereabouts, it was her words that ultimately led to Yoshikazu's sentencing. Therefore, it comes as no real surprise that sensitive information pertaining to her and her family would be withheld. That's to be expected. What's not expected, however, is that there's not even the slightest trace of this information left to find. It's as if it simply never existed. Therefore, I cannot help but consider alternate possible explanations. And I remind you, this is mere conjecture. But one question keeps nagging at the back of my mind. Was Yosh Yoshikazu Yanagihori really the murderer of these three victims? Is it possible this crime was not actually perpetrated by him at all? Think about it. In his final days, Yoshikazu was incapable of communicating with others through speech. And despite his childlike reversion, he'd always been a personable and friendly man. As the saying goes, he wouldn't have hurt a fly. All his relatives, friends, and neighbors confirmed as much. Shocked to hear that such a kindly man could commit these unconscious, unconscionable mm -hmm. atrocities. He certainly had no motive for the crime either. There was nothing for him to gain from it. Except tongues. <laughs> and an eyeball. Then again, he eyeball may soup. simply have lost his mind. Look at his father. Ugly. It was around this time that Principal Takamine Yanni... Yeah, Yanagi Hori suddenly began speaking in tongues and acting in a most peculiar way. Speaking in tongues? He did ah. it! <laughs> Not to mention scribbling incomprehensible gibberish all over his walls as if possessed. He seemed frightened of someone and would often be found crouching in the corner of his office, moaning and thrashing when visitors came by. If he could wind up in such a beleaguered mm -hmm. state with no warning, then perhaps so too could his son. I believe that we're looking at a curse far more powerful than anything man could devise. And then they open the school back up? No, they didn't. This is yeah. a different school. From the time it opened its doors to the day it closed them forever. Heavenly Host Elementary School sealed basement room has existed as some form of cursed ground. Skizzers. And to Let's find, find a rock. the underlying cause, we must go back behind the infamous kidnapping and murder incident. We don't have time. Back a whole 20 years. Oh, God. I believe I may have found a clue that could shed some light on the situation. It may be a bit far-fetched as leads go, but it's a lead nonetheless. Regrettably, since Heavenly Host was not only closed down, but demolished altogether, and another school built in its place. That's a good idea. It's no longer possible to investigate the basement room directly. But my protege has found what may be the next best thing! A time portal! Big old bag of Skittles.
Oh man, not the tropical kind. It's sour. Something. That, well, that's even better. Something that could make the impossible possible once more. The possible preparations are being made to pursue this lead even now. Be sure not to miss the next installment. It may be the scoop of a lifetime. Next time on Dragon Ball Z. Ko Kabiki. Something about dates. Give me a save. Let me save. Continue Thank to chapter you. five. Fuck yeah. Awesome. We did it. Whew. What a... That was... That was gross. That was a gross chapter. That was... Yeah, that was rough. I don't like it. <laughs> <laughs> so, I mean, Girl in Red is the killer, but who the fuck is Girl in Red? What does she have to do with anything? What's her deal? I don't know. That's what we'll find out. Girl in Red. And then what's Hodor, the gyroid Or maybe there? maybe one of the characters is Girl in Red. <gasps> and that ghost is a fake. That doesn't make any sense. <laughs> She's not a ghost. It's fucking nerd girl. It's Yuki. Yeah, I don't fucking know. I'm just throwing every name out there. This is Dong and Romp all over again. Mm -hmm.